The streets of downtown Davenport flooded once again for the 49th BIC 7 race. Thousands of people started pounding the pavement early this morning, and News 8's Joe McCoy shows us how this tradition brings an entire community together. From rookies. I never ran seven miles in my life. To seasoned vets. This is my 22nd year running. To Elvis. <laughs> Over 10,000 people were picking up the pace during the 49th annual Vic 7. I wanted to get under an hour and I got 59 minutes, so we're happy. Rock Island High School teacher Isaiah Tubbs stands above the rest. The atmosphere, the crowd, uh, the people on the sidelines really cheering you on, all the different things going on as you're running really kind of motivate you to push. I've done a lot of races in other cities and there's nothing like the Vicks, to be honest. It's, it's a party the whole way. Melissa Korf has fond childhood memories of the Vicks. I started when I was 15 um, and I was just walking with my mom and my friends and then as I became more of a runner in my 20s, I started running all of it. For all participating, last night's rain was a blessing. When I saw 70 on the weather app, that was exciting. I've been running like 80, 90 degree weather, so this was awesome. After running seven miles, proper rehydration is key. And if you live on the route, you're throwing a party in your front yard at 8 a.m. And, uh, and it goes all day long. For Keely Parker. I went good. The hills were hard. This, too, was her first time ever running seven miles. I just came in and went, just winged it. <laughs> the last mile, that was fun. Everyone lined up at the end and all the signs. The signs are really cool. With the pain over, the party begins. <laughs> But not everyone is drinking the same thing. Even though it's free beer, I don't like bush light, so I got standards. <laughs> In Davenport, Joe McCoy, WQAD News 8. Congratulations to all the runners out there today. All roads are expected to reopen downtown by 6 o'clock tomorrow morning.